listen to me now Gonna say it loud Don't get it twisted What we're talking about Okay, now, this is a serious video, y'all, a seriously serious video. There's a young lady, um, on the internet, let me get her name right, because I don't want to mess her name up, I mean, even though her name is going to be on the title of this video. Gosh, am I not able? Okay. Her name is Brooke Houts. And go to her channel so y'all can see it. Brooke Houts. That's her. And Miss Brooke did a, I guess she was tr filming a YouTube video with her Doverman puppy. I'm not really sure how old the, the dog is, but she said in her video that he's still a puppy. And dogs are considered puppies after a year. Because he's, you know, he's a nice-sized dog. You can tell he's not a full-grown Doberman, but he's a, he's a decent-sized dog. So, I guess the majority of her YouTube channel and, and I guess her Instagram kind of revolves around, you know, her dog. A lot of people, you know, bring their dogs into their YouTube videos because, you know, people do love animals and those type of videos get a lot of views. So she had filmed a video and I don't know how the outtakes instead of the real video was uploaded. And in the outtakes, she was, uh, you smell your tree. Come here. In the uh, outtakes, she was seen punching and spitting on her dog. Literally hitting the dog and spitting on him. In the outtakes. So I guess when she realized where she messed up at, she took that video down and uploaded the real video that was supposed to go up, which was, I guess, a, she was doing a prank on her dog that... Um, where you take the saran wrap and you know it's supposed to confuse the dog or whatever she uploaded that and you know of course people took that video and you know started spreading it around so the police are supposed to be I guess doing an investigation on her she did release an apology a, a backhanded apology saying oh well my dog isn't being abused but what is abuse you hitting and spitting on your dog that's not you don't consider that abuse come here come here boo boo no come here y'all know this is my baby gizmo and i would never allow anyone to hit or punch him. He trying to get this tree. That's the only way I can get him really to come on here, boy. To come on camera is if I give him a treat. But hitting and punching? This is a rescue dog. There is no way in the world I would allow anybody to hurt him. I don't even like taking him to the groomer. And he need a haircut so bad. But I don't like taking him to the groomer because he gets so stressed out. And I don't want them to hurt his feelings. I would rather trim his hair myself than take him somewhere where I know 
you know, he's going to get stressed or he's going to feel uncomfortable. Of course, I take him to the vet to, you know, get his nails trimmed if his, you know, if his nails start to get too long or whatever. But I don't like to put my dog in a situation where, okay, you got to go. Go down there. Here, go, go get it. Go, go down there and get it. I don't like to put him in a strip in a situation where he's gonna be stressed, and I definitely wouldn't put him in a situation to be hit. So I need y'all to uh, go and uh, look up this young lady's video. It's not on our YouTube channel anymore, but if you Google her name, that video is gonna come up. I want y'all to look at that um, video. Obviously, more people need to start speaking up so something can happen to her. You don't just get to abuse animals and then go on to your YouTube like you ain't did nothing. That's ridiculous to me. You punched and spit on your own dog. And you're acting like ain't nothing happened. I, I don't understand this world. And y'all, y'all done canceled uh, James Charles for that little dumb stuff that he did. But this woman just gets to continue to live. She got 300,000 subscribers on YouTube. She should have no subscribers. You punched and spit on your own dog. And you have 300,000 subscribers on YouTube. Where is cancel culture when you need them? Now, this is something that truly should be canceled. This woman is crazy. But that's the thing, though. She's not a woman. She's a little girl. She don't know how to handle that dog, does not know anything about dog training, and is not trying to learn. Now, I know my dog. He ain't trained. So, ain't no way in the world I'm going to be trying to have Gizmo on camera doing tricks. And I know he's not trained to do no tricks. So, I wouldn't even put myself in that position to want to hurt my dog when I already know Gizmo ain't going to act right. He just ain't going to do it. I need y'all to go and uh, Google this woman's name and um, go check out the video. Because if you Google it, the video will come up. Uh, something needs to be done with Sister Girl. Okay? Where's Peter when you need him? Peter, I'm going to need y'all to go and knock on Sister Girl's door and check on this dog. I need a welfare check done on this dog to make sure he okay. For real, for real now. Because she didn't got all this uh, publicity. She probably didn't beat the dog ass for real. I need somebody to go check on, uh, the. I think the dog's name is uh, Sphinx. I need uh, uh, Dog Protective Services to go over there and check on Sphinx. Because uh, Sister Girl over there spitting on him and stuff. Sphinx, you need to bite her. Shoot. All right, y'all. I'll talk to you later. Bye. For the money to for the show. Don't play me, honey. This is how we go. Oh,